but for the candidates like in general at some point you would have felt like okay uh, you have to decide when to get into the gearing mode of you know the preparation when did that happen for you can you reveal a bit i know that sometimes people don't want to reveal their seconds and so on but whatever can be revealed here sometimes they're uh, revealing their certs <laughs> no but i mean uh in my case i mean yeah of course having camps uh training i think i've uh, worked really a lot and um i think i just took this decision at some point that i have to prepare otherwise i mean it's uh, like coming there it's like you know they will just destroy you i mean it just feels when you when you are like having the same kind of level and you play against each other and um you don't feel this imbalances uh i mean while watching yeah you see that okay he's making good moves the other guy is making good moves this one is prepared better this one a bit worse but in general it's like in boxing yeah otherwise it's like in boxing so the super heavyweight goes against uh, 55 kilograms and there is one punch and it finished it's more or less like this in chess but there you will see the difference because the guy is like two meters and the other one is like 160 or something and then the punch comes and it, uh, it's finished and you will say okay it's unfair yeah because the, the one is like super heavyweight and the other one is 55 kilos so it's a different story but in chess it's you don't see it because i mean uh, every <laughs> everybody is 100 kilos <laughs> <And> <laughs> <laughs> and so uh, they fight against each other and um, so you don't see the you know like a visual <laughs> visual difference there is no although okay, in uh, chess chess the originals when they will come here there is a boxing ring yeah for for both the players to fight at anish and vidit for so, anish and vidit yeah. yeah i don't know there may be some boxing but in general in chess as you rightly said but i think it's still a very lightweight <laughs> lightweight championship <laughs> Once you start to drop in terms of preparation, once you start to drop psychologically, I don't know, physically as well, and uh, chess-wise, then the difference becomes quite huge. You start to, you, you may tilt. I was afraid of it, of course, because also um, together with the health issues, with, with this kind of tiredness, like all this and medicines and so on. So it's like, you know, at some point you think that, okay, I'm, I'm, I'm not sure if I'm not tilting after losing a few games especially it, it, it happened in the you know in the beginning rounds so that was very unpleasant so i was trying not to tilt it didn't come easy yeah it was hard because i also had to still keep this like i don't know the composure and everything you know against the top players in the world and not to tilt it means that not to lose a lot of games um to keep yourself well you also have to try as wide so yeah quite complicated at the time it was i mean in terms of uh coming back Mm. So I think that the game against Nakamura brought me back into the tournament fully. Yeah. But I think